Hello, 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 people. Welcome back to the channel. It's been a minute, but I am back now, and I am back with my first game in the FM Works Cup. I'm playing up against a good mate of mine, a guy called The Mulch. He's a co-host of the Unbelievable Streams podcast. I'll link to it down below. But just before we do get into today's game, I'm going to explain to you what the FM Works Cup is and why I'm taking part in it, because there is quite a big prize. And so, you can see that this is a FM Draft Tournament. We've got a £500 million transfer budget. It's one-off games, a world player pool to choose from, two minutes per draft, and 20 players max per round. And so, winner receives a place in the FM Super League Season 5. That is what I'm going for Curty, if you're watching, you might be the current reigning unbeatable champion, but I am coming for you. And so that is today's game. I'm going to go away, do the draft, and then I'll be back with you guys in just a minute for the start of the game. Hello guys, we're back and the draft has just been completed between myself and Mulch and I'm going to say it right now before the game, I am confident as hell about this game. I'm expecting a very good win because this is the team I've got and the tactic I'm going for. It's a tactic I know very, very well. So I've got Livakovic in goal. Cresswell at left back, Fofana and Paul Torres are my centre back pairing, Benjamin Pavard at full back, and then in the middle of the midfield, it's Fernandez alongside Rice, and then up front, we've got Madison and James Ward Prowse alongside Kylian Mbappe, playing in an unfamiliar shadow striker role, but I've got all the confidence in the world that he can do it. And then up front, it is, of course, that main man, Erling Haaland. And then on the bench, we've got Mattia Perrin, Eric Garcia, Eduard Payet. Maybe he can come on and get himself back into my heart. Ryan Gravenberch, Yusofa Makoku, and Adama Traore. Lingard and Rodriguez were the extra picks, but they just miss out. Here we are, it's game day. Please let me get a win. I don't know why I'm saying please, I'm feeling very confident. So let's go and get into the dressing room. Right, see, so are we going to be able to see his team first? Not quite sure how draft mode works all that well. So no, let's just go into the dressing room. And then I'm going to go pump my fists. And I'm going to go get out there and impress me. No real reaction there, but... When you talk to all the groups individually, that usually works better, as it has there. So let's go and get into the kickoff. Okay, first highlight of the game. It's him in his Wolves-esque looking kit. Alan St. Maximan with the ball. And he goes to Calvin Phillips. When he picked Calvin Phillips, I knew my next pick had to be Declan Rice because of the banter we had on his podcast about who was better, Calvin Phillips or Declan Rice. But none of that matters right now. But Mbappe's shot is easily saved there by Ke Ilian Messier. And now the ball goes long. Pau Torres forward to Rice, to Madison. And Madison with the ball goes over the top. Ward Prowse is in and Ward Prowse is shot. I think he thought he was playing rugby there for a minute. And well, while we're waiting for the next highlight, you can see Mulch's formation here. He's gone for a 4-2-4, I think you would call that. Meslier in goal, Tierney, Laporte, Van Dyke, Perea. And then in the middle, Kante and Phillips. And we'll come back to the rest of that after this highlight. Mbappe with the ball out wide. He gets into the box, does he? Yes, he does. He squares it back to Declan Rice. And ah, oh, I would love it if Declan Rice scored the goal to win this game. And now, all oh, immediately following that, he's got a corner, but Torres has headed it away. Only as far as the big Dutchman, Van Dyke. Harry Kane out wide into Calvin Phillips. 
and Kane waved a ball and his cross has been blocked and that's gone out for a yet another corner ball. And now just to finish off his team, he's got Sane and St. Maximan on the wings and up front he's got Timo Werner and Harry Kane. But I'll tell you now while I'm confident because he picked Harry Kane as his 11th pick, I think that is. And that left him with only like 25, 30 million for his last six or seven picks, whereas I still had over 100 million. So my strategy is to wear his team out and to be able to bring on better, fresh players off the bench than he can. So hopefully that will work. As now Fernandez comes in, Mbappe with the shot and Meslier with the save. Meslier is having a decent game here because if you look here, if you look here at what he's got on the bench compared to what I have, Exan Alioski, Axel Tuanzebi, Ismailiasar, Tyler Roberts, Koke, Bellingham, and Curtis Jones against Perrin, Garcia, Eduard, Payet, Gravenberch, Mukoko, Adama Traore. I am so confident. I will be shocked, I tell you, if I lose this game. One more highlight, possibly before half-time, as I've got to sort my cameras out. Well, I think that's better, but we've lost the ball. Calvin Phillips forward to Harry Kane, and he's got a man in space if he wants to use him. I think he's gone to the wrong one there. Sane with the shot, and Livakovic with the nice, easy save. And now, what is Livakovic going to do with this here? He's gone long and Laporte heads it away and yeah, really need to sort this camera out. I'm going to go just back to normal TV for now. As now Kante to Laporte, St. Maximan nods it down into Harry Kane's path. Back to Calvin Phillips, the pound land Declan Rice. He's gone to Perea, to Maximin. Maximin with it, he crosses it in, goes to Werner with the header and thankfully that just goes wide. And that is all you're getting for the first half. It's been a very even game. He's had nine shots to our ten, six on target to our three, but our XG has been better and possession has been very, very even. My tactic's not done what it usually does just yet in this game. It's usually a very heavy possession, ball-dominating tactic. It's not quite worked just yet, but I'm still confident that it's going to. And so I've said to the players, I'm not happy. Go back out there and win this game. And now immediately into the second half, St. Maximan, Perea crosses it in. Livakovic with the catch. And now what is Livakovic going to do with this? He's gone long. Can Haaland get this? Yes, he does. Nods it down to Ward-Prowse. Ward-Prowse with the ball. Back to Declan. Declan Rice, come on, Deckers. What are you going to do, mate? He's gone for the long shot and yeah probably shouldn't have done that, mate. A minute or two later, we've got a corner ball. Ward-Prowse with it. Phillips heads it away. Goes back to Ward-Prowse for a second attempt. He plays it into Fernandez, And Fernandez's shot is off the line. Perea has saved Mulch's arse there. A lot of highlights in this second half. Both teams trying to win this. As now Kane with the ball plays it in, but Pau Torres clears, but only to another man in orange. Tierney goes long, Pavard clears, Phillips gets it forward, St. Maximan, Kane, Kane with the ball, back to Perea, Perea with it. And can we please get this ball back? He's crossed it in low, Maximan with the save, and we've cleared it off the line. Two efforts there, cleared from off the line for either side. There's a goal coming, I can tell. As now, from that immediate throw in, Tierney throws it in and all goes over Sane's head, only as far as Torres. And now it's Laporte. Laporte with it, into Kante. Kante gets it to Werner, into Kane. Sane, Maximan, no, oh, what a save. And I think it was offside anyway, so it would not have counted. We're only 10 minutes into the second half. It feels like it should be a lot more. But Ward-Prowse forward to Madison. To Declan Rice. And can Declan Rice do something here? He's gone to Haaland. Haaland with it. Back to Ward-Prowse. Into Madison. Fernandez. He's got a man in space. Can Madison turn? No, he can't. He does eventually. Cresswell. Fernandez. Ward-Prowse. Haaland. Ward-Prowse. Madison. 
Cresswell, Fernandez. And now Haaland. Oh, what did Haaland do? That's that's an own goal. What? <laughs> Mate. Oh, my gosh. What an own goal. What has happened there? Oh, my days. What a way to take the lead. Let's have a look at this again. Pereira just passing it into his own net. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And now immediately following that very, very lucky goal. All we've got to do is hold on now. But Phillips goes to Van Dijk. Van Dijk wide to Tierney. Tierney with it. And he goes back to Laporte. Ward Prowse is intercepted. Come on, Ward Prowse. He's got Haaland in space. Cross it, my man. Cross it. Oh, he doesn't. And Laporte manages to make the block. And it goes away. Pavard. Fernandez. Mbappe. Rice. Rice forward to Mbappe. 2 0. No, it's off the post. Oh, I'm certain that was, that was a goal. Oh, my days. The highlights don't end. Mbappe. Back to my man, Cresswell, who crosses it, but not very well. And then it goes to Timo Werner. Werner with the ball. Into Kane. Maximan. Maximan running at our defence. He's into the box and it's taken a deflection into Livakovic's hands. Half an hour left of the game. Pavard to Ward Prowse. Ward Prowse with the ball. He crosses it in and Haaland is beaten by Van Dijk there. St. Maximan with the ball. Again, he's running forward at our defence. He's got a lot of space because of our formation. But he's not done a great deal with it as of yet. And then having said that, he's run into the box and he's sc he hasn't scored. But his shot has gone in off Harry Kane's arse and gone into the back of the net. Lucky. But also, I'm kind of glad because I don't want to win by that own goal that Malt scored, if I'm going to be honest. But that was a great run by Maximan. Harry Kane knew nothing about that goal. But of course, he is going to take all the credit for it. Okay, now making a couple of changes. Bringing on my secret weapon, Adama Traore. He's coming on as is Payet. Ward Prowse and Madison have made way. I think we're going to go extremely higher tempo. And we're going to go... Yeah, we're going to leave it fairly wide. We're going to leave everything else as is, but we're going to try and wear his team out. Hopefully, Traore can run at the defence. And actually, you know what? I'm going to change Traore and Mbappe. You might think that's a bit of a mad move, but I want Traore to run at the defence. And so, let's see if this mad tactical gamble works. 20 minutes left of the game. Sane with it. Into Werner. Into Sane. Sane with the ball and, yep, nicely done there by our defence. And now, can we get this ball forward? Come on, Livakovic. Livakovic has gone long. Haaland, two Fernandes, two Dekers, Kylian Mbappe, Traore. Come on, run at the defence. He's in, he's in past the defence. And, oh, oh my gosh, that's another, that's another goal cleared. Oh, what is it going to take to get a winner here? Phillips with a corner for Mulch. It's gone away. And now it's a Triore again. Now running at the defence once more. He's got Haaland. He's got Haaland ahead of him. Past the ball. He has. And Haaland with it. And Haaland in the back of the net. And we've got the lead. Yes. I am a genius, boys. Absolute genius bringing Triore on. Look how fast he got that ball away from their corner. And then once he'd crossed it, I don't think it was ever in doubt that Haaland was going to score that, was it? Oh, are they saying this might have been offside? Never offside. Whenever they show these replays, it's never offside. If that's one thing they can change for 22, I'd like it to maybe sometimes actually be offside. That would be nice. And so he has made a couple of subs, I believe. He's brought on Bellingham for Kante. And I think that's about it. I'll have another look in a second. And now Cresswell into Payet. Payet with the ball. Goes back to Cresswell. And now Cresswell. What can he do with it? Can he cross it very well? He's not in a position to from here. 
but he's played it to Haaland, to Mbappe, to Pavard out wide, back to Declan Rice. Declan Rice's cross is blocked. And now Werner. Werner's in behind our defence here. Is there going to be another twist in this game? Werner's gone for the shot. Livakovic has saved it and Cresswell has booted it away. We're going to drop back down to positive just to try and see this game out. Five minutes left. Perea with a throw in. Goes to Kane. To Perea. Fofana. And then Haaland back to Traore. Traore again running at the defence. He's in a load of space. Can he win it? Can he win it? No, he can't. He might just be the closest thing in football to Usain Bolt. Because he can run fast as hell, but he cannot kick a ball. Livakovic now back to Torres for us. Pavard. One more goal just to wrap this up would be nice. And now Declan Rice into Traore. Traore with it. Traore, he's in, he's in, just cross the ball, cross the ball, Harlan, yes, your boy's through to the second round, your boy Taylor made has done the mulch here, the mulch is mulching, he's melting, he is beaten, he is beaten, yes, look at this, Traore coming on has changed this game, Oh my gosh, he made it the easiest goal Harlan will ever score. Yes, my boy. And also, just before the game ends, I would like to point something out. Declan Rice, 7.0. Calvin Phillips is on a 6.7. I think that ends the argument once and for all. Declan Rice is better than Calvin Phillips. I would like Maltz to admit that. And now Haaland's in. Haaland could get a hat-trick here. He has got a hat-trick. Your boy's taking the piss now. 4-1 to the tailor-made. 4-1 to the tailor-made. Yes! Step one of getting to Curti is completed. I have destroyed the Maltz. Curti, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for your belts. I'm coming for your trophies. I'm coming for everything, my man. And that is how you win a game of football. That is how you prove that Rice is better than Phillips. That is how you prove that I'm a better manager than the Mulch. Yes. In all, in all seriousness, no. Mulch, I love you. Mulch, you're a really good guy. It's all just banter. And yes, there goes the trophy lift. Yes. Let's get into the dressing room. Outstretched arms. Congratulations, lads. And that is the end of that game. And so that is where we are going to leave it for today. If you've enjoyed that video almost as much as I have... Pop a, pop a like down below. Subscribe if you is new. And follow me on Twitter at TaylorMGaming. Follow me and subscribe for bus simulator content, FM content, FIFA 22 content when that game drops in a couple weeks. It is all a whole lot of good stuff. And I'm a member of the Passion for FM team. Check out all the Passion for FM boys. Links will be down below, as will links for Mulch's podcast and his Twitter and all that other good stuff. Thank you so much for watching. I'm off to go and rub it in Mulch's face. The fact I won. Not anything else. Get your mind out the gutter.